Now I'm going to show you just one project that you can do with these beautiful screens. Look at these Arabian screens, aren't they gorgeous? And what we're going to use is this download. Now this is a multi-download here and you can layer it up. You don't forget, once you've downloaded this project, you can print it off as many times as you like. Now what I've done is, uh, let me just show you some of the other examples here. Now. This project's obviously in the Arabian screen section. This is just a few of the different Arabian screens that are printed off and uh, cut out ready to use. I'm just going to show you one project, but don't forget there's going to be loads more on the site. So you just go hunting for them and you'll find them there. But you can see you can get them in different sizes. You can join them all up together if you want to. You can crease them so they fold in different ways. Just a few examples here of just some of the uh, screens that you can actually print off. Now what I've done, I've already, what we do is actually, I'm going to use this size here. Now all you do is cut out around the outside of the screen here and then also the little bit at the bottom. Now you can either keep that in like I've done on this one or you can cut those bits out. I like to keep them in because it makes the screen a little bit more sturdy. It's entirely up to you what you print the design on to, whether it's a, a, a 90 uh, grade gram grade gram shut your gob um some, there's always somebody butting in isn't there anyway 90 gsm or 250 or 240 or 260 or 120 it's entirely up to you i think this is 120 that i've gone on to so basically all you would do is cut that out and then crease it with a bone in with a knife let me just do it for you and a ruler and all you do is once you've cut it out you just go on there you take your bone in two or a, a, an old ballpoint pen that doesn't work anymore and you just crease it so you know exactly where that's going to fold gives you the perfect fold there I like that so it's not going to be looking like a dog's iron leg now I've got all these bits and pieces here and you've got the two beautiful marble effect flowers here and you've got a marble background here too and now we're going to make a beautiful screen up using all those elements so there's my first screen let me just show you a few different ways of using this so there's the screen now I've actually scored all of the different points there so it folds up like that and it opens up and gives you that concertina screen but you could have not scored that one so that when it stands you've got those two there and that one at the end that just bends and you've got the straight one in the middle or you could have it so that the two outside ones and the other three on the inside so it's like a little flap of a door or something like that so it folds that way and you could design but I'm going to use two of these pieces here so I'm going to fold that up as I would that's how I'm going to use it there like that but I'm going to use these two bits here to put my design on so I'm going to open that up and flatten that down a little bit I've cut all the bits and pieces out from that and there's my first one and you can see that's got a black background now to stop that I wouldn't normally crease that if I was going to do that with this uh, design I'm going to stick that across the top there it's done onto card and you've got the beautiful design there and that's going to strengthen that also so then you're going to have the center bit there that is straight with the design on and then you've got the bits that fold in there either side that you can create that effect so that looks really nice but if you want you could have that going that way and then you could have those two going out that way like that so it's entirely up to you how you use these screens lots of different ways of using it now I'm going to decorate up the main panel to give it a lovely effect and I've cut out some of the pieces here as you can see and I've put double-sided tape on the actually foam pad on the back of this one and I'm just going to layer this up it doesn't matter if it comes out of the frame I'm going to a little bit I'm going to be a little arte with this one this one the first one I'm going to stick down here I'm going to stick it down flat so I've just got a little bit of glue on the back and that one's going to stick down there flat. Now it can come out of the top of the screen if you want to, but I'm going to keep everything contained so that when I put it in the envelope, no bits are going to get damaged. I've got the second one here. Now this has got a little foam pad on the back, which is going to raise it up a little bit. And I'm just going to tuck that underneath there, overlap the other flower. So you're getting that lovely kind of 3D look. Isn't that beautiful? Then I've taken some of the leaves and I'm going to add those. Now I could go directly over the top and give that true decoupage look, or I could just slightly off center it again like I'm going to do with this one, or I can move it completely. I think I'll stick it underneath there. Why not? You're the creative one, you can do what you want. And I've got my other bits and pieces, that one can go on there I think, like that. And I've got another one here that I'm just going to slide underneath there. 
So it gives that effect there over there. And there is my design finish. So I've converted that beautiful screen there into a freestanding screen, but it's got that lovely flower on the inside. And to make it stand, when it, comes, when it goes into the envelope, it's like that, and it'd be flat. When it comes out, it will stand like that. And isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful, all got that beautiful marbling effect to it. So if you want the different Arab effect design uh, screens, you've got loads of different choices, you've got different sizes, but while you're in there, go and have a look in the Arabian section, you don't have to use the Arabian designs, you can use any designs on these screens, because they're kind of geometric, you could use Oriental on there, Japanese on there, Tibetan, anything you want. So you can make some beautiful screen cards, so just go and choose what you want, mix and match with the downloads and the 3D decoupage or the toppers, anything you want.